long. Um, so anyways, Armored Core, pretty basic game. Um, in this game, you pretty much operate a big giant mech that um, is used for as a massive tool of destruction. This is your signal while we gotta go back to Zelda, right? Yes. Um, the Zelda cursed me. She she's upset that Lunk has decided to call it quits and um, curse my gaming systems. Okay, so, but yeah, I have to get used to all the controls. Thank God it's got everything telling me what to do. Um, so it shouldn't be too hard. It's nothing like the old games I've played. Um. And right now, it, what's even worse is it's giving me the controls for keyboard, but I'm trying to play on a pro controller, and it's just kind of chaos. Um, so everything it tells me, I just got to figure out myself pretty much. Oh, what's that? Whoa! Rapid fire right hand weapon. I think I know which one that is. I don't know what I just did there he's mad you went for armored <laughs> chorus <-y> instead <laughs> that is great that's good stuff um so that uh, no that that is not my gun that is that's my gun do i have anything on the other side no okay 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 this is like a glide and this is really fast you used to not be able to do it this well on the old games. Um, target assist on off. I would appreciate some target assist. I'm not that good yet. Use right shoulder weapon E. Use left hand weapon. Okay. Is like the left click. So that must be the right trigger finger. Okay. Oh! Oh, what am I doing? No! No! I I think I almost died. On the tutorial. I, I almost died on the tutorial. Why? Okay, hold E for a multi-block. And, um, it does have huge Metal Gear vibes. You are not wrong. Okay, I think... I think I'm getting a grasp on the controls. I feel like it would be just better if I did keyboard. But I would have Gamer's Claw. Pretty much where my, my fingers are just locked. Uh, use repair kits to repair your AC and recover AP armor points. Oh... Uh, repair kits can be used up three times per mission, but cannot be used in rapid succession. C to repair kit. I don't... Your AC's taking damage. Patch is it... No, that's not a... No, that is definitely not it. This is... This is gonna be a very big learning curve, guys. I don't... I don't... No. Whoa! No, 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 stop, 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 stop that. Stop. Thank you. No, no, no. Um. I might have to just switch the key. Oh, no, never mind. I figured it out. Rush Ram and did some uh, sin grade checks. Unfortunately, nothing's more. Oh! That reminds me, how many people have heard about the new uh, VR headset for Nintendo Switch? Because I just literally... <laughs> it's in <incredible. laughs> Yes, yes, throw one on there. I screwed that up. Time to fly, 621. My name is 621. Thought I named myself Cole Ranch. Is 
And I don't have Gray's voice here to tell me that I said it wrong, too. I am truly going to suffer. <laughs> April Fools is over. Oh God. Okay, uh, shift. Oh my God, none of this means anything to me. Like it's just literally telling me what I can do. I'm just casually walking here. Get out of my way, I'm walking here. There's that other guy. I'm pretty much... I feel like I'm almost like a drunk driver right now, acting like I know how to drive. Okay, I don't know if I will be able to fill the hole left by Gray's absence. Ah, uh, yes! <laughs> I, I almost said something horribly inappropriate by accident. Um, I'm, I'm just going to throw it out there anyways. Yeah, <laughs> Gray's holes aren't as... Gray's holes aren't easily filled. <laughs> That just sounds a lot of wrong. <laughs> okay, I think. Okay, I think I'm getting a handle on this. Plus, right, I'm actually running two computers. I'm running on my gaming PC, the game, and then I'm streaming on my uh, desktop. So I'm hoping it's going well. Ooh, that, that is big. Okay. Um, is that on my side? My side? Get the hell out. <laughs> hey, 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 hey now. Okay. Can I just walk? Thank you. Just let me walk. Let me click on it. Anyways, um... So, the Switch VR headset thing was an April Fool's joke, is what you're saying? I know I'm like going all the way back on that. Corp license, easily traced. You'd think the video would get taken down though, I like seen it for the first time today. I did, I was skeptical because part of the commercial was a person driving with it on their head, so I was like, hmm. It's either a joke or Nintendo created like the most unsafe thing ever. Oh shit! I'm going to die by like. The easiest guys of the game. Okay, rockets working. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> I would have to say, I mean, um, the whole. I really hated it. I think everybody hated how they did Pokemon Arceus and then um, did Scarlet and Violet. So it's like, 
But that's a Pokemon company's fault as well. There's this one creepy ass mess ad that had to be banned. What? Yes, I need to see that. That. I can feel Gray laughing in the background like he knows exactly what you're talking about. Never! Oh, he's still alive. I just assassinated him. Just stand there and shoot him down. Ding, ding, ding. Analyzing. And I think I talk about this every um, game I ever play and at, but like it's. When I choose a new game, it's not like a for sure thing that I'm going to stick with it the whole time. If it's not working out, I will drop it. So depending on how this game is, um, depends on how long it will be streamed. And we might just move straight over to the horror stream then. And for those who haven't voted on YouTube, please do. I just heard the notification, thank you. <laughs> I almost want to kind of play it on um, stream, but I don't know how inappropriate it is, so I'm going to hold on to it until I uh, can watch it off stream. Oh, um, before I was just like reiterating uh, what I usually do when I play a new game is just um, because it's a new game doesn't mean I'll stick with it if it's just not working out. Like if I end up like thinking it's so, so abysmal that I can't play it anymore or if there's technical issues or if it's just not that fun. Um, They were going for reverse psychology and failed horribly. Oh my god, there there is so many bad ways you can fail at reverse psychology. I'm afraid to see what they did. That wasn't nice. You must die. What? This is this is this is a lot of guys for a first tutorial playthrough. Also got awful CG. Hmm. <laughs> Did I get him? Okay, I think I killed him. It looks like my boost doesn't last that long. Oh shit, there's a lot of them here! Okay, one repair kit. Can I just like jump jump? No, I have to use boost. Okay, I think, think I got him. Let's see about this license. And this was on like a cheap, cheap ass NES system or a NES game? Monkey Gordo. License code extracted from AC, wrecked in a contaminated city, blah, blah, blah. 
Oh, it's television. Hmm. Oh, it was for the NAS. Oh, uh, maybe that's why I never bought it. <laughs> I'd have to see it. Oh, so my ammunition is low. I use my last, my, I'm down to my last repair kit. These people are shooting me in the back with missiles. Um, while standing on a vertical catapult, perform a jump to quickly reach high up places while on catapult vertical launch. Aaron, but it was banned from in Australia. I feel like Australia is maybe a little looser than um, the United States with their advertisements and stuff. I'm not sure. Well, that's interesting. There's a surprising amount of cursed ads by Nintendo. Nintendo, yes, I fully agree. They are not. We. They are not the best at um, advertising. Try accessing the wreck. Great games. Horrible advertisement. Okay. So, oh, this guy got fudged up. So I think I'm stealing license for work from these guys. Oh shit! He is not on my side. He is definitely not on my side. And he's huge. But it doesn't matter. Take it out now, they won't have enough to ID you. What? This This is a little much. Do I? Do I? He is huge. Oh shit, what is he shooting at me? Stop. Almost. Oh no! No, let's go! I gotta take cover! Cover, cover, cover. Thank you. Um. He, he is blowing everything up. This was a tutorial boss. 3900 for Rush Ram. E. Ascend Assault Boost. Um, I think that's what I was doing. I like how in um, example it makes it look like it's really easy. I don't even know how he killed me. Um, restart from checkpoint. Yes, this already reminds me of Elden Ring, where small wiener bosses completely That's destroy it. you. Try accessing the wreck. Okay, so he's going to come from that way, so maybe if I get the jump on him now? There he is. Oh shit! Come on, Doc. 
please die. Please die. I would appreciate it if you would just pass away. AP at 50%. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. Give me a break. Oh, sh Where is he? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Please die. Did I get him? No, I did not. He's still alive. He's still very much alive. I, what? What? Kill me too. This is this is the first boss. I have never played an armor core game where you got spanked this early on. Try accessing the rack. Registration number <laughs> Death plus unlimited? Okay, there we go. Like they were on to you after all. I'm in no mood to pick a fight with the PCA. But it doesn't matter. Take it out now, they won't have enough to ID you. Is there am I like shooting at the wrong parts or something? Use your mobility in the air to get clear of explosions on the ground. Mobility of the air. Where'd he go? Oh shit, he snuck attack me! Two repair kits remaining. I'm scared. I don't even know how I died. He's too far away. That's cheating. Did I did I get him? Did he die? That was a heavy That's combat helicopter. Here's the call sign from that license you picked up. So this is crazy. So that was a heavy combat helicopter. I am in a mech suit that I'm a, a regular size human body. Waiting for Wildcat Lime to begin. Oh, that might have been for the first um thing. Let me hop on. You're talking on YouTube, right? Yeah, that's... That might have been from the first hiccup. Let's 
Let's see if I can get rid of it. Mm -hmm. Deleting it forever. Yeah, that's exactly what it was. Thanks for the heads up. Hello, Destroyer5. How are you doing tonight? Oh, I forgot to see uh, how much money I earned from that. A sublime substance. Discovered on Rubicon, a planet on the frontier of developed space. For a time, Coral was a revolutionary energy resource and data conduit. Happy Coral National Fear Day. Human society um, I am doing powers. well. I had some kind of weird stream hiccup before, Coral and, um... Yeah, storm of flame yeah, but it's better now. Stars, leaving lethal contamination in its wake. Uh, hello, I like Coral, money. Have what? To have been utterly consumed, forever lost. Oh, like Mr. Krabs from SpongeBob. That's funny. Embers continued to burn. Humanity would inevitably return to stoke the fire. To stoke the fire. So, is Earth like destroyed or something? Registration number RB23. Call sign Radio. I didn't see, I didn't really, um, at first I couldn't tell what the crab symbol was, um, until I looked on the YouTube and then I could see it more clearly. Nah, just wasted. This is all <laughs> the mercenary support system. Cheers to you then. Welcome back, Raven. Because hopefully I'll get there. My um so we made curry the night Looks before. Like the and it wasn't bad. Raven. But today we found out the little one could not um his guts weren't quite used to curry Take and we had to deal with a horrible screaming fit child all day because of gas pains and that's on us, but restoral of access privileges. All Mind provides a combat training simulator to support mm. its mercenaries. Your license was in a suspended oh, state. Oh, I see. God dang it. I'm sorry for misreading that. Incentive, completion of the exercises will be rewarded with AC parts. You stand to benefit regardless. I think it's because I'm drinking beer. Maybe I am the wasted one. More wasted than Earth. Okay, can I, um, following features now available. AC design. What can I do with it? Um, assembly. Usually, in all the other games, they've never given you parts to start off with. <laughs> Don't drink and stream. It's horrible. You'll look like a fool doing it. It's not cool. I think, um... What do I want to do? Okay, there we go. I think it looks fine just the way it is. Um... Back unit, yeah, it's it's prob I probably don't have any other parts to go off of. Yeah, this is everything I have already. <laughs> right. I <laughs> little do I know there's a warning sign by my uh, stream every time it launches on Twitch. Also, um, ooh, decals. Okay. Um, gray. Ooh, kitty. Yes, we gotta go with a cat. Why not? Um, oh, I can put this where I want to put it. Okay, it's, it's going right. Or does it, can I put it on the arm where it just looks, yes. Kitty. Gray <laughs> in memorial. Um, the left arm will stay gray. Um, for gray. Image editor. Ooh. 
Oh no, no, I don't, I don't want to get into the super techy image editor stuff. You guys don't need to watch me. Um, okay, that's how. Lizard for lizard, I like that. Um, I'll do that. Left arm is going to be a lizard. I like that. We'll we'll stick with it. Also, um, I think um, if I understood um, X or what I prefer to call it, Twitter, um, correctly, um, Austin um plays birthday is today. So if you know him or anything or participate in any of social media, wish him a happy birthday. I don't directly work with him in that, but I do watch his content. He's pretty good. Um, ooh, we gotta paint it. What? Oh, crap. They put, go into detail. Merry Christmas. <laughs> if he, I would be honored if he was watching my stream. Ooh, I like that. Should I be lazy and just go with um, the default paint? I like that too. That's not bad. No, don't go. Don't be lazy with um, the paint. Oh, Ooh, we got green. I like that. I'm, I like that a lot. Oh, oh no, you're not in this episode. Da, 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 na, 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 na. Um, was it the light? And, um, I think we'll, do they, do we have a purple theme? I like, I'm going to be weird. I'm going to have one arm, just something else. I'm going to look like one of the, ooh, Jet Black doesn't look bad either. Do I want to paint my guns? I don't... I don't want to get all Fortnite on it. Um... This triggers my OCD riddle brain. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, I'm going to... <laughs> I'm going to make it even worse. I'm going to have the head look something completely different. <laughs> Um, we're going to go with purple for that. <laughs> the, it's not meant to be whimsy or wonder. It's supposed to just reflect, um, the randomness that always goes on inside my head. Okay, um, we're sticking with this. At least use complementary colors. Absolutely not. <laughs> They, these are all flamboyant colors. They complement each other perfectly. Just fine. Beautiful. Look at that. These fit together as well as Nutella and steak. Um, some people might actually like Nutella and steak. Turned into desert. Ah, uh, okay. Sorry, I was, I'm a little slow on chat. Um, what's AC data? No, no, nothing much. Okay. <laughs> um, so it said I could earn parts training. Fundamentals training menu. Yeah, we'll begin training. Actually, I think I have access to the shop now.
Maybe not. Maybe I don't. Um, I'll do training. Barrels one person. Okay, to land shots on a moving enemies, you must pull the trigger while they are within lock on range where target tracking is active. I didn't figure out target tracking um, for the pro controller. Ooh, I got a new gun and I like it. Okay, weapons with magazines will automatically reload when the magazine's ammunition is depleted. Manually reload before engaging the enemy to minimize the risk of your attacks will be interrupted by a reload. Um, so R plus... So I think... Nope. Once again, Pro Controller is not being kind. I'll figure it out along the way. Use missiles in other rounds. Keep the enemy on screen until lock-on is complete, then fire. Some missile weapons are capable of multi-lock, which allow you to attack multiple enemies simultaneously by holding the input for the weapon. I feel like I, you were forced to learn that right from the tutorial. Oh, nice, I got them all. Uh, melee weapons equipped to the left hand require a risky close range approach, but have high attack power impact and are useful for destroying shields. It's just a shiny lock for me. It might be, you could be fighting a lost cause this whole time. Completely missed. You did not see that. No one's seen that. You can detect nearby enemies by containers that hold AC parts by scanning. Oh, how do I scan V to scan? Which is what? Nope, that is not what I want to do. Oh. Peekaboo, motherfucker. Um, question of the day. Question of the day is, do you think we will ever get to the point where we have big giant mechs to uh, <laughs> fight people in? Uh, are you on controller? I am. I'm using a Link Pro controller. I was going to use my Xbox controller, but um, I had a um, ship. I had a um, floating joystick which I really hated, so I swapped to my Pro Controller, and it's even different learning curve <laughs> than the Xbox controller. So I'm like pretty much learning the controls completely. The tips are no help whatsoever. I'm learning on the go. Oh, he's alive. Die, please. Like where we have big giant mechs, I know we're at the point where um, AI is getting a little too ridiculous. I watched um, I watched this one video where this guy um, had like a top half of a robot and it, it was humanoid based, you know, it had, it had two hands and that and a core body. And what he did is he had a bunch of plates in front of it and an apple. So... <laughs> that was Tokyo. I think they built like a big giant model of a Gundam. Um, it's not actually operational, I hope. Otherwise, we'd be screwed. But anyways, this robot, um, this guy was commanding. And he's like, um, 
I can't remember the name, we'll call him Steve, and he's like, Steve, put away the dishes. And what the robot Steve did is he grabbed the dishes that are laying flat on a cabinet. He'd pick them up, put them in, you know, kind of the slots that were designated as where the dishes were supposed to go. And did all that, and then the guy's like, Steve, take the dishes um, out of the cabinet. And then uh, Steve, the robot, grabbed them all, and he set them back down where he got them. And then he's like, Steve, put away the silverware. And he took the silverware, he grabbed a fork and knife, and he put them in a little cup holder thing, and he, and he brought them back out. And then with the apple, he's like, hey, Steve, I'm hungry. Can you get me something to eat? And then Steve kind of looked around, and he looked at the dishes, looked at the apple. And then he grabbed the apple, and he gave it to him. And the guy's like, thank you. And Steve's like, you're welcome. And the guy's like, okay, Steve, why did you give me the apple? And then Steve stopped for a second. He's like, well, um, you wanted something to eat. And the only edible item on the table was the apple. So because there was nothing else edible, that's why I presented you the apple to eat. And I was like, what? I, that is scary how far um, AI has gone where you can program it into a robot like that and it can already tell stuff apart and it's scary. Shutting down the moving. Okay, they have a few models. They are shutting down the moving Gundam. What? I never got to go there to see it. Give me one second. I got this little space heater that is super hot. I stream in my grandma's basement and I need a little heater to keep me warm. Kidding, I own my own house. Okay, um, let's see. Can I buy parts? I can do AC tests. Test AC performance. I don't think I need that. Replay mission missions. Okay, assembly. Maybe I have to do it through assembly. Okay, there's a weapon I just got. A machine gun developed by a bomb. Has excellent rapid fire output, but somewhat lacking in firepower when used alone. Shines in double trigger builds. Uh, whether using two of this weapon or a combination with another. So, no, it looks like I can't put on my left hand, so... Because I believe you can carry two guns. <laughs> oh my god. I, um... Just imagine, like, what, what, I, I'm pretty sure they'll exist one day, but just imagine them bringing you a birthday cake. <laughs> a little scary. Um, I don't think I have a story yet, so I guess I'm going to do a mission? Um, okay, yep. I got no store, so I'm going to do a mission. Um, check incoming jobs and sort tile on missions from the missions menu. Complete missions to progress the story. Cake is filled with poison. Is it filled with poison in, um, in the game portal? Okay, so destroy artillery installations. Grid 135 cleanup. This one has less, um, and then with the armored car, there's a lot of missions that coincide, so one will be like a little dinky one to help clean up units or turns or something, but that will actually benefit you, um, if you take another mission further down that is relative to it. Oh, is it a normal chocolate cake? I always assumed there was something bad with it. Sent by Dafung, a Balam company, and a competitor. Grid one three five is a key foothold. Oh, that would be cool. Efforts to conduct a coral survey in the contaminated city. You 
the independent mercenaries are the key to maintaining our lead in the Coral Survey race. The Archivist Group looks forward to news of your success. Briefing over, and happy hunting. That's crazy, like, big giant corporation wars. Just imagine if Walmart and Costco just went head to head in the future with robots over um, competition wars or our companion cube plush plushies. Yes, I need one now. Take my money. Um, I want. I like. Okay, I still have my old gun, so we're going to stick with that. I did not like that machine gun. I'm sorry. It's so stupid, but I can't get over my blue arm and my pink purple head. I'm like a very confused um, Metal Hulk right now. I must not want to. Main system activating combat mode. <laughs> I'm so, I, I will change it back eventually. I'm just doing it for funsies right now. And I like I ha how I have that little beeping when my energy's running low, like it's um like it's a minivan with the door opening. Enemy attack! What I see! Shit. The Archibus group hired some muscle. An independent mercenary, huh? At least they didn't send the Vespers. Intercepting! They're just mass produced and pieces for Lego said I have to use the piece that. <laughs> that was my whole childhood. Um as a kid I got a lot of hand-me-down Legos and none of them were like matching sizes. So I never could correctly build a decent house. Um, my house always um, had red and white shingles, or siding I should say. Oh, he's so... Oh, these guys are a little bulkier than last time. Oh yes, I know what exactly what you're talking about. Your safety pilot sharp. Focus your fire. There there's a lot of cool ones. I can see my whole entire um month paycheck <laughs> disappearing if I um watch that too much. Still shooting at me. Oh, it must be that guy that's shooting at me. Oh, shit! I ran out of juice! I'm... Oh, I thought it was like game over when that happens. Other games that did. There are also good Monster Hunter ones, but the instructions are locked behind a patron minus Rathos. Oh, freaking patrons! At least they have like Rathlos available. Or are you saying they don't have Rathlos?
Why isn't my rockets locking on? There we go. There we go. Rathalos better be free. It's like the MVP of Monster Hunter. Mission complete? Mission complete. I got paid. Ammunite expenses 20,662. Repair costs 12,262. Ammunition costs. 8,400 Income is 47,338 I don't like this job <laughs> Don't think it's the best monster, but it's definitely the I um I think it's because of um Just uh, nostalgia Because when I played very first monster hunter when it came out and that was like the main they had such a huge focus on it. They had other stronger ones than that, but it was like... Rathlos was definitely the flagship monster, and I think that I got sucked in with that one. Plus, I really like dragons, and I really like his design. Oh, yeah, it's definitely a mascot. And in the Monster Hunter um, movie that they rolled out with, it ended up being a big baddie, too. Oh, there's our my parts shop. Um, I think I'm going to sell this, um, machine gun. Yeah, I'm going to sell that. I, I, in my honest opinion, I didn't think it was that bad. I would probably give it a 6 out of 10. Um, there were parts I did really enjoy about it, but I, the way they kind of went about it was kind of dumb. So, but it was, I wouldn't say it was a waste of time watching it. Okay, so these are can, uh, burst rifle, burst rifle developed by Boz. Consumes kinetic ammunition to deliver on reliable offensive potential. Both in terms of damage and impact can be charged to fire burst shots. Hmm. Kind of looks dumb though. I don't... Ooh! Ooh! I got a pistole! Little pistole for me. Um, attack power is not that... It's a little better. Rounds are 196. So I have to be careful with it. And there's a big old bazooka. 78 rounds. Attack power is way high. I, I'm going to try this bazooka. At first I thought it was too broke. What can I... Ooh, I can put it for my left hand too. I could do dual bazookas. Ah, uh, no, I don't think I'll do dual bazookas. Can I do another rocket launcher? I can. A standard uh, pulse shield developed by uh, Tacky Gua Harmonics. Generally unmarkable in terms of performance, but is well balanced for its low EN footprint. Also offers a relatively long initial guard duration for ease of use. Okay, so it's it's pretty much a shield. Um, I could get another rocket launcher just like the one I have. This one is a dual missile launcher. 
I don't have money because I'm broke. Ooh, I can get, I can make myself look thick. <laughs> oh, the algorithm is attacking you. That's what I have. Ooh. I do like medium builds. I have no money for it. Oh, look at my legs. These are definitely a lot faster legs. Um, those are standard. I'm... Ooh, there was like one more set that I want to check out. Oh, boosters. Boosters, and what is this? Alright, establish itself as a true missile... Oh, so it's like a it's like um a chip to increase my missiles um abilities. Generator. Okay. I'm going sick with my bazooka. Do I have another shoulder? No, and do not have one. Yeah, steroids. <laughs> okay, um... Another mission. Missions. This one. Got a job for you, 621. This is an open call from the Balaam Group. One of the corporate forces occupying the Yeah. Gun. Attention all independent mercenaries! This request comes from our affiliate, Dothum. The Rubicon Liberation Front has deployed Baos artillery throughout the Oof. contaminated city. The city itself has no strategic value. And we cannot allow them to hinder expansion of the Coral Survey. Show us your ambition. Destroy the no. Liberation Front's artillery. The Liberation Front's pay will be awarded for destroying their MTs. We want the enemy weakened. I'm I'm gonna say it will take more being at the rate you're going. How many did it take for you for Groudon? Um Sortile. I don't know. All the times I supported you on the streams and said you were going to catch it, you haven't yet, so but, ooh, I hope it doesn't get there, but... Bum, bum, bum. Activating combat mode. Commence mission. Destroy all of the Rubicon Liberation Front's artillery. I'm kind of like adventuring out because you can find random parts hidden on the maps. But they could be literally anywhere. And I don't know if they're going the same route as just having them kind of um, randomly tucked away somewhere or if they're in some kind of chest or something. Bullied by a fictional dragon. Well, these guys did not want to wait. Oh, I forgot that I don't have much ammo for this thing. This was probably not the best gun for this mission. I do like that. He uh, doesn't have that money. <laughs> I was just talking about that with him um, last night. He um, he's That's getting close. The the front is protected with armor plating. Attack it from behind. Deploy for combat. Destroy that AC. There's only one of them. We can do this.
Wiz. Oh, yeah. I'm not, like, doing no damage to them. They've got big explosions. haven't had any real good luck you'll have to be like some of these other people who have to get like um like three three 3ds's to um make it work out oh shit what did he hit me with two repair kits remaining Oh, he was a weena. Just a little weena. Just need to buy three more three. I um completely understand. <laughs> God, what the heck is going on here? Hey! Cannon was not a good choice. hit hard. One repair kit remaining. I don't know if I can lose body parts in this game. I think I can. Shit. What just hit me? not going to survive this. If I go around? Clear out the artillery here and our work is over. I don't know about that. Liberation front strong. Forced in act, we stand as one! 
I'm going around. There we go. It's one down. Hey, buddy. See over here. Was two enough? No. Little wiener keeps on moving. Oh shit, that hurt. Really nothing it isn't even good shiny at <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry you suffer so much for this. Oh hey, buddy! I didn't see you there. Frickin' squatter. Um, how many more do I have? And who else is shooting at me? I feel like I'm getting shot at from somewhere. I'm I'm starting to think you did because that um confirmed. All targets destroyed. That's kind of around the same odds you had with that one other one that you accidentally reset on. Mission complete. I made absolutely no money from this because it all went towards repair kits, ammunition, and armor. E Ooh, oh my god, 58,000? I'm going to have to probably use alumina, the aluminum cans for my baked beans to patch up this thing at this rate. I'm gonna be too broke. Registration number RB23. Call sign Raven. Your records have been updated. You have also been granted access to participate in the Log Hunt program. Log Hunt we program. We kindly request that you submit combat logs after destroying designated craft. All Mind will reward you with parts based on the number of submissions you provide. Oh, that's new. I've never seen that before. Long Hunt, you have been invited to join Long Hunt, um, one of the All Mines mercenary support programs. Discover and destroy the targets marked with the Long Hunt target icon to obtain combat legs for submission. Oh, it's got the spider legs. Collect combat legs logs. My bad. Um, and improve your hunter class to receive reward parts for All Mind. <laughs> I mean, you gotta do what you gotta do. It's, the clock is ticking. Who knows when they're going to shut down the servers for um, the DS systems. I don't... I like the cannon, but I feel like it's... Um, takes too long to shoot. I don't want to get rid of my blade. I don't like this gun. I'm going... I'm definitely going to get a shoulder. Do you think the shield will work really well? I 
I hope your luck's not that bad, DB. Yeah, I'll buy it. I'll buy it. I need a different head, too. I can't afford the heads at all. I can't afford anything because I'm broke. It's the same gun I have. The right hand. Nope. Broke. I'm broke. Okay. AC design. Assembly. I think what I'll do is I'll match the paint. Every Everyone think I should match the paint now. Weapons, weapons. I need more weapons. Well, not let me put it. Oh, okay. I have nothing. Put that. I'm changing his gun out. I thought I got a pistol. Maybe I didn't. Actually, I'm going to keep the cannon because I got another rocket launcher. I might be too heavy, but. I do want my other arm to be a different color. Don't judge me. Ooh, that looks sick. I like that. I that's I'm gonna have my purple arm. <laughs> then if it's that much of an issue, give up on it. We won't judge you. Nobody in chat will judge you. I will I might silently judge you a little bit, but you don't don't need to worry about that. Okay, um, destroy all the Rubicon Liberation Front Logistic Helicopters. Extra reward based on the number of enemies destroyed. Ooh, destroy the... the... I think I'm gonna go for this one. I hope it lets me edit my AC before I jump in. Got a job. Because a cannon is not going to be good for this. Raven, this request comes from Dafa, one of our affiliates. The group has committed to use of military force to handle the Rubicon Liberation Front. I've been working for this company for this a lot. Is a squad of transport choppers. I think I, I think I just. Serve, uh, guerrilla resistance from Baus mass produce MTs. Oh, maybe I'll You're stick no with my concern. weapon. Performed adequately in your last sortie, Raven. This did not go unnoticed. Ooh. We will be watching with interest to see what you bring to the team. Am I going to get a bonus? Like a raise? I know it's only my third day on the job, but... I guess we're going sword dial. Now they're asking for you by name. Keep building your rep. But my name isn't... My name isn't Raven, it's... It's Cole Ranch. Brother to the Spicy Nacho. Main system, activating combat mode. Commence mission. Destroy the Rubicon Liberation Front transport choppers. I wish I had a sneak feature on here. You can't hit me. You can't hit me. <laughs> Confirmed. Transport chopper down. Keep at it, 
Let's see. I should have, like, looked into... Kind of cheated a little bit. Looked into where all these hidden parts are around the game. I mean, you, you're you kind of luckier than me. Let's stop. have that much luck. <laughs> Thank you, Craig. I think it was that one lucky time. I haven't had much luck after that. Okay, this um, this dual rocket launcher thing is really nice. Oh, there's my car door alarm again smells like smells like team spirit oh okay i i i misinterpreted that run over the cars run over the cars i have a feeling that there's some something juicy hidden over here I just have that feeling nope no, no, no juicy steak. Unless that's a top. Top. I feel like if there's going to be equipment hidden here, it it's going to be around these buildings before I go inside. But maybe I'm wrong. Okay, slow down. Slow down. Take it easy. Nothing. Nothing. No cool hidden weapons. What's with them? Looks like they've got a Baus tetrapod. It's a cut above the other MTs. Ignore it and focus on the mission. Oh shit! He hits like a truck! And no, I can't ignore that guy. Oh, is that another AC? Yes, I am. I 
I'm pretty sure I was supposed to anyway. <laughs> this whole time though. I hope they actually pay me for it though. Cheers, everyone. Gerbil, gerbil. I might have to go get refills. Ah! Ooh. And that's it for the tutorial. Now we play the actual game. Long hunt program progress. Okay. Hmm. Wait, am I supposed to be reading these messages? I see your back, 621. Or is this a mess? The corpse see the Liberation Front as a hindrance to expanding their coral survey. But to the Rubiconians, your actions are only helping the corpse with their invasion. It's just a job, 621. All of it. Um, it's not a job if... You get to the point where you're not going to have a job anymore. Okay, let's buy some juicy stuff that I can't afford. Um, let's see. Um, AP goes down. Um, attitude stability? Does my machine have some attitude? Is it kind of emo or something? Is that what it's getting at? <laughs> if you can't see colors anymore, maybe it is best to take a break because then you'll never find a shiny. Lightweight head part developed by... Oh, I don't want lightweight. I want, like, medium. What do I have right now? Okay, I have something else. I kind of like this one, but it's saying I'm going to be too fat. Current load. My head covers the current load, so I can't see. Yeah, everything kind of goes up pretty good. <laughs> um, I think I'm going to stick with that. Hmm, look at the legs. Do are these boosters? They hmm. Um, I feel like these boosters would be worse for me, so maybe I'll stick with what I have right now. Mission. Um, destroy the tester AC. Oh, so that was not the tester AC I destroyed. Uh, destroy the defig core industry tester AC. I wish I had a machine gun because there's sometimes you can get a Your Gatling gun for the back. I would really like that. It's an open call from the Archivist group. To all That's because this request comes from Schneider of the Archivist group. Dafung, one of our adversaries allied with Balaam, has introduced a new tester AC. It's a sample model from an external architect, featuring extensive okay. assembly optimizations. In the hands of an experienced pilot, it will pose a threat far too great to ignore. This brings me to the request. Intercept delivery of the tester AC. Destroy oh, that's because they're watching. The they're always watching. Briefing over, and happy hunting. Hmm. Yeah, it's interesting. I'm probably going to get the same kind of ads on my phone now, too. 
Shit, I just think about stuff now and it somehow knows what I'm thinking. And I always thought my mind was always super random that I couldn't follow it, but I guess I'm wrong. Right. Main system activating combat. <laughs> I won't be surprised. I, I'm not surprised by anything like that anymore. Commence mission. We've got okay. a read on the target. Now's the time, 621. Am I going to get sabotaged? I feel like this is a place that would have a hidden part, so I don't want to, like, all suddenly jump down and it's like, Oh, it was behind you the whole time! Nope. I don't see anything. Over here? Maybe? Oh, this is like the same area I was in before. Left my door open again. Ooh, it's got like this weird atmosphere right now to it. Oh, shit! Dude, I was not ready for that. He, uh, he got the jump on me. And he's He's, he's kicking my ass for a trainee. The training is paying off. Two repair kits remaining. This AC has reached breaking point. Go for a direct hit. Damn it. I can't die like this. The red guns need this AC. I, I can't fail this mission. I'm sorry, but you have to fail, because if you don't fail, I die. And I don't want that at all. Oh! I just... I just wanted to call sign of my own. Enemy AC destroyed. That's it for this job. Can I, can I take his parts? No. No. Oh, that was easy. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, the long hunt's improving. Oh, shucks, I'm out of beer. You, you, you might have to take a healthy break, BB. One new message. I think like an hour break is not going to kill you. Six two one. About the tester AC you downed. That was being shipped to the Red Guns, Balaam's in-house AC squad. Hmm. Wait, you told me to take the mesh in, and then you're like, hey, don't be careful who you're messing with about the missions you take on from me. Okay, I got no other parts. I do like this head, though. I might, I might change the head. Do 
because I don't like my current design. That, it kind of doesn't fit the build too much, but it looks better. And now watch, he'll be too heavy and I can't do anything. Okay, missions. Attack the Rubicon Liberation Front's dam complex and destroy all generator facilities. Or, ooh, this one has more money. Destroy the weaponized mining ship Strider, a key military asset for the Rubicon Liberation Front. Will I have both available to me? I think so. I think I'll have both. Um, what I'm going to do is actually um, go and take a quick bathroom break. Um, short little break, and then we'll hop back into it. Be back in maybe um, a few minutes, about three or four minutes. So. Quick break, everyone.
Okay, I'm back. I had to get more beer. But, um, let's jump right back into this, um, Armored Core game. How's everybody liking it so far? It's, um, definitely constant action. Well, that's pretty neat. Check the briefing. That's fine. Heard the good news from Walter, it's not you? like, um, good. a super it's engaging game. It's not like, um, Tears of the Kingdom where you have to pay attention to what NPCs are saying and that, and to your surroundings, finding rare stuff and that. The objective is to destroy their lifeline and make it's, sexy it's 100% person. just a search and destroy game. Oh. I'm assigning you the call sign Gun 13, a lucky little number that just became available. Gun 13, sound off! Hmm. Good enough. Now go get ready. We're going on a field For a moment, I thought I had to take those two guys on. I'm like, I'm screwed. Unless they sabotage me. I'm not 13. <laughs> 13 is unlucky. That probably means I'm going to be screwed. Gun 13, huh? I'll stick with 621. Yeah. Don't you know what's luckier than 7621? No, they're people who operate robots. Instead of just sending a military person against another military person, they just send a military person in a robot against a military person in a robot. That way you can waste more resources. So what is going to go on if I have these three guys helping me? I feel like something big is going to happen. Make us all a sandwich? That sounds really good. Okay, see you in the bit, great. And then you have to tell us what kind of sandwich you're making. You are you're not doing anything, buddy. Gotta have a good sandwich. No luck with a sewing club, I see. That attitude won't get you far on Rubicon. Hope you pilot better than you sew. Did he just like just run right past this guy? He did. 
Those cheeky bastards. Is there like a weapon? I really want a weapon. This guy keeps on like sitting out. I don't like that. I don't trust them. Is he going to die? <laughs> the evil Walmart Corporation. Did I, I? I did most of the work. Looking for a weapon, looking for something cool. I wonder what would happen if I would have turned on the other two guys. Perfect spot for me. Oh, he hit. Oh, I thought that was one of the jump pads. Oh, so is it like they can't destroy it without me there? sitting there. I have very little English learning, but I'm looking forward to working with you. Um, hi! Um, person? 
How are you doing? I'm sorry, I can't quite read your name. Is there anything we can call you for short? Is that what I'm supposed to destroy? Is that whole building? There we go. Looks like my good for nothing's were good for something after all. Field trips over. Got 13. I'll keep that lucky call sign open for you. Is Samuel S. Say Tommy? Oh, I didn't lose that much money. Well, welcome to the stream, they told me. I hope I'm saying that right. I don't mean any disrespect. One new message. <laughs> you got lucky, Merc. You were the only warm body they could find. The red guns are going to be first over the wall. Have fun watching from the sidelines. That's correct language how I use. <laughs> I I'm sorry, DB, but I used uh I used um Google Translate to see what you typed in. <laughs> I am Japanese, not Chinese. Okay. I'm sorry about that. Oh, I see. I see what's going on. I'm going to sound really ignorant, but it is hard for us to tell the difference if we're not versed um, in the language, so we do apologize for that. It's like one of those things where if you don't really... Um, understand it or read it too much it almost looks the same but different um let's see en capacity i feel like all these parts are junk oh i could get those these big thick thighs legs Ah, Sortile. And I have one brain cell, and it's always complaining that it's locked in here against its will. Destroy the weaponized mining ship Strider. Okay. Should I keep my energy sword, or should I have my cannon? I will have to say, um, even though I don't speak or read Japanese, thank you, because anime is my, um, part of my soul, pretty much. Um, no, I'm actually playing this on a PC, so it's through Steam. I don't even own a PlayStation 5 yet. That's kind of, I feel like that's kind of sad. Call it the crowning. 
you nerd. Corporate force. Your attack will focus on the eye, a giant laser cannon. I'm a nerd who plays on a PC. It's protected by a shield, which is powered by auxiliary subgenerators. These should be your first targets. Okay. This concludes the briefing. Good luck. What? Is that why the tape keeps on peeling off? <laughs> I find for a little self promotion. I find out this whole time I'm just playing on a cardboard box that's painted Smash black. The Strider and Archivus HQ will be sure to remember your name. These, these are just fancier microwaves. Uh, with the beep that it's putting off, I believe you on that part. Um, it gets it gets really warm in here when the thing runs too long. This reminds me, I don't know if it was on, um... Armored Core 2 or Armored Core 3. But they um, had a mission like this where there was this really long um, weapon tra weaponized train that you had to destroy, and it was like kind of in this kind of environment. Sandwich! What? That camel frickin' shot me! Picking up a surge of energy to the eye. Watch out. What? Um What was that? I was not expecting that. Main system activating combat mode. Commence mission. First, get through all that dust to make contact with the Strider. An unidentified AC. Must be one of the corporation's dogs. I am a friend. Yes, sir. Coral, abide with Rubicon. Abide with Rubicon. It still hit me. Okay, there we go. But the missiles still hit me. Like a piece, please. No repair kit remaining. Oh, I have no repair kit. That really sucks. I don't think I can, um, get on top of that. Okay, I did destroy the leg now. Does that mean it's cool? Compromised. It's going down. Oh shit, I'm in the way! I'm in the way! I'm in the way! I don't know if I can die from this! 
Oh shit, don't go on it! Ooh, I'm gonna die. Grab on and get to work on the sub generators. Okay, I think I'm good. Is that all I had to do? I think I have to go behind it and jump on. Oh shit, I'm being attacked from above. Listen, sword and shield. No. Don't let them go. I'm supposed to stop that. We can't take the enemy I made it. Remember, we fight for the coral. Defend the sub generator. Phoebe, you better not be harassing. them do not harass Satomi they're a welcome guest oh <laughs> Honestly, I don't know what you said, but just, um, I had the feeling, but I, I won't say no more. Oh, shit. These guys mean business. <laughs> yeah, you know what? It's okay if you keep it regulated to me. Don't bring, don't bring anybody else into this. Don't like it stepping. Oh, I was supposed to destroy that. Am I supposed to go over it? Oh yeah, that's not good. That is not good. I don't like that. That is no bueno. Oh, can I destroy it? I'm going, like, keep cover. I'm going to play the coward's route. Shit, that did a lot of damage. I'm hurt. I am really hurt. I got no heals. I think I'm... S Maybe I gotta take these other things out. Okay, that is not doing anything. Just one left. 
one lap? Can't even hit that thing. Six two one. There's another sub generator on the underside. Slip under the ship and destroy it. Dun, 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 dun. Sorry, I had to check something real quick. All sub generators destroyed. The ice shield is offline. Head to the front segment and hit the target. Oh, that thing. So the thing on top is that was like blowing the hell out of me. It is finally down. Give me ups, uppies. Now you've got the target in your sights. Time to finish this six to one. Can I like go here? Is it going to hurt me if I'm? Okay, good. There we go. Yes, I do. If it's on my server, I get a message for every notification sent. <laughs> Oh, is the notifications coming through on chat? Oh. Am I supposed to get out of here? Oh! I was supposed to get out of there. Oh my god, I died from not leaving. Don't judge me. Don't judge me on this. Now you've got the target in your sights. Oh no. And I'm going to die now. Oh, it didn't do that last time. I I really don't like that big giant eye. Owies. There we go. Now, this time I'll actually leave. <laughs> um, I couldn't agree more. And it looks like all that energy was I will leave this go. time. Move six to one. You need to get clear of the strider. 
How how clear do I have to get of it? Like this small little sand camel can't possibly have that big of an explosion. Still the two. <laughs> yeah, I have a listening issue where if someone tells me to do something, unless it's for punishments or something, I don't do it. Even when it's the game. Mission complete. Mission complete. Sorry, I was too busy looking at chat, and it's like, you're supposed to evacuate. I'm like, oh, crap, too late. You must be the handler, I presume. From mm -hmm. the mercenary raven. Honored to make your acquaintance, V2 Snail. I understand you want to join Operation Wall Climber. The Gliok fight that happened on my very first playthrough, like episode one. I'm supposed to fight both of them? One new message. One new message. Raven, your work on the Strider deserves commendation. I am thrilled to have issued you the request. Allow me to introduce myself. I am the Archivist Group's mercenary liaison. V8 Pater, at your service. I think I'll enjoy doing business with you. Thank you. New exercise data added to training. Ooh, does that mean I get a part? <gasps> New parts. We gotta check out the shop. I mean, new merch is always better. What are you? The Hailman. It's a shotgun. Close range shotgun developed by Balm fires a spread resulting in an excellent impact. I'll bet the, with a short range. Regardless with this weapon offers unparalleled potency in close range engagements. So pretty much this could probably take place of um of a saber. What are you? This must be a, some kind of sniper rifle. Laser rifle developed by um Aquabus. Aquabus. Uh one of the most commonly used laser weapons on the battlefield. This is a flagship product uh for the corporation can be charged to amplify its power. Ooh, this must be another laser weapon. Um, plasma rifle developed by the BCPL. Plasma explosions create a damage-inflicting area that remains active for a brief period of time. Charging a weapon causes the plasma to fire scatter, producing multiple explosions. Hmm, that sounds like this is just trouble for me. I do like, um, this guy. This guy might be a little too bulky for me. I could buy it and try it out. Oh. Oh, I got a laser cannon. Laser cannon developed by Aquabus. This is the enlarged version of the standard laser rifle damaging or uh, rem 
re-imaged as a back-mounted weapon, charge the weapon to amplify its power. I... Do you think I should get it? Ooh, plasma missiles. So this is all, like, energy-based. I'm, I'm, I'm going to get the gun. I got to get the gun. You know, someone puts a gun in front of you, you got to buy it. Okay, I got reverse legs. Okay, these are heavier. <laughs> Oops, I'm sorry. I let it slip out again. <laughs> okay, ooh, look at these legs. Right now. Aquabus. So Aquabus is like an energy-based company from what I'm gathering. I would be... I'd be up for it. I don't know. Um, buy some whiskey, get a free gun. <laughs> That's like Wisconsin's motto. <laughs> get some whiskey, get a free gun. <laughs> I need, I need better generator Texas state law <laughs> those whiskey salesmen are really desperate oh by the way did you hear um um I think maybe you get a rifle um or maybe like you upgrade it to like you can upgrade from a pistol to like a rifle or something or I don't know it's Texas. But did you hear that Texas is entering not a state of emergency, but I think, um, like, um, the, some kind of state awareness, I think it's called, um, because of the eclipse that's going to be happening. No one, it's a lot of items. Good luck. Oh, God, I'm afraid. see the details with the FE. I think it's not letting me because um I'm on um do, 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 do. there we go chat box is kind of in the way unfortunately um let me like minute close this up a little bit do 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 do, do. oof there's a lot of red there. I do not like that. It's not even worth it. You know my motto, if it's in the red, it'll leave you dead. I'm going I'm going to take the cannon. The shotgun is tempting, but I think I'm going to leave the shotgun. Hmm, but I will take the plasma rifle. Oh, I guess I haven't really, um... You try until you fail, then you never try again. To get help. So you can look at the item descriptions. Ooh. I like that. Thank you. Let's go back to the art shop. Oh, that is so nice. I wish I would have done that before I bought the laser cannon. Nope. Still want it. <laughs> I still want it. Oh, that is nice. 
Oh. That is a nice rocket launcher. I am. Um, I'm all. I like E. Oh, and that literally has like a little shield. It reduces damage. It doesn't protect you from all damage, I see. Let's take a look at this shoddy. Take that, Pilgrim. They told me you have like really opened my eyes with this. Okay, um, what's this look like then? Ooh. I want, I want that. But, um, my EN low doesn't support it, so. And I think it had a new training. I think I can get new weapons, or, um, new parts through this. And if they're junk, I can just sell them. But yeah, Texas is having a solar eclipse. And they're expecting almost a million <laughs> I take advice from you all the time, DB. Um, they're expecting almost a million people to arrive in Texas for uh, the solar eclipse. Isn't that crazy? Oh, I like that. What gun is this? Can I have this unit? Okay, the ACS's attitude control system of a craft can be compromised by accumulated strain from the impact of repeated attacks. You see overload results in a vulnerable state called Stager, which during this time as afflicted craft will be immobilized and susceptible to critical damage. Oh, really? Okay, that's what the shield is. Or... I can charge with the shield up? Cumulative strain, AC strain inflicted on enemies resets after a brief interval, but a portion of that strain will remain. Weapons vary in amount of accumulative strain when they inflict the explosive impact during relieving the most AC strain. Hmm. Oh, they don't fight back. Okay, surprise attacks. Attacks on enemies that are unaware of your presence will inflict greater ACS strain than usual. Do 
dun, 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 dun. Okay, shields equipped to the left shoulder can be deployed to reducing how many damage. Oh, okay, that's what I've been doing this whole time. Okay, shield output is maximized for one to two seconds after deployment. Blocking during the initial guard window can help minimize incoming damage. Okay, so I could have probably used that during that big boss fight at the beginning. Give me parts. Give me parts. Okay, during a self boost, rush attacks, small arms that can be used during movement will inflict greater impact, and impact you receive will be reduced. I'm. I know, I'm being mean. I'm being mean. Was it? Ooh, what is that? I'm going to name it Curtis. It's going to be Kurt. Let's take a look at this. Ah, uh, Kurt is not. Bad. Maybe I'll maybe I'll equip it. I'll give it a shot. I got a feeling like um, on missions in the future it's not going to be that good. After a name, um, teriyaki. Only reason is because I had some teriyaki sauce today. And some pork steaks. It was wonderful. Training, give me more free stuff. I might have had too much beer. So I think I mentioned before, over um, by us, it's national, um, in the US, it's National Beer Day. And um, we have this little gas station that likes to double up as a grocery store and at multiple deer, beer day. <laughs> um, teriyaki is the best. I like teriyaki um, on certain things. Um, I don't like it on jerky. I know that sounds weird. I don't like this guy. I don't like his bill. I make teriyaki chicken at home all the time. And I kind of use it as a substitute for bourbon chicken, but um, it's like teriyaki bourbon chicken I make at home. And it's not much of a change of like regular bourbon chicken, you just add teriyaki to it. <laughs> the generators installed to your AC greatly influence the reset of the assembly from the selection of unusable parts to the basic performance of the AC. This AC is equipped with a generator that prioritizes EN capacity in order to allow extensive use of aerial maneuvers and quick boost. Oh, that's cool. Okay, so I can duel use weapons 
FCS engagement distance, the FCS fire control system installed on the ACFX targets, tracking in close, medium, long range, and missile lock on, multi lock on time. The AC is equipped with the FCS that is specialized for close range combat, allowing it to reliably land attacks with the high fire power. Fire power weapons. Maybe I am having a little too many drinks. <laughs> Congratulations, you are experiencing like the longest hunt for Rush Ram ever. I, I. This machine is a little too destructive for me. <laughs> I got I have like a little bloodlust going on from this. All the weapons and selections of parts used to assemble the AC determine an ideal combat range and style. It's obvious. Now the AC is equipped with four range weapons to specialize in concentrated fire and medium range. I prefer like I like to be well balanced with everything. This thing is this thing is brutal. I want it. Can I have this thing? I think I have the parts in um, the shop. I like it. I want it in real life. Give me it in real life. Ooh, um, a SD card. Generator. Are these any good, though? I don't want to put them in, and then they are garbage. Rust. Mm. That's a lot of red, my friends. That is a lot of red. I don't like that. You know um, what they say. If, it's, if there's a lot of red, it keeps you in bed. Ah, this isn't too bad. My weight's going to be way over, though. Whoa, that's nothing. Okay, um, we're going to do another... We're going to do the last AC test because I'm part greedy right now. I want my parts. I want them now. And then we're going to go back to some missions and then we're going to call it a night. Oh, I have my... Am I just in the test thing? Oh, I don't think I entered a mission. I just entered a test. That was pretty silly of me. There we go. Reverse joint parts. Ooh, like those um, cheetah legs. Reverse joint legs. Units excel at jumping and can also leverage their leg strength to improve quick boost. These leg units are also capable of high jumps that do not consume EN. 
making it easier to achieve aerial uh, retreats and shift to aerial combat. That might be better for me. Ah, uh, the left shoulder grenade cannon. And the AC fires explosive rounds that cause the area damage upon impact. When using a weapon of the same nature, you can exploit area damage to a great effect by firing the ground at the ground from the aerial position. Hmm. Oh, but it has a long recharge time, it looks like. Boing. Boing. Oh, the short that I posted got 385. I was not expecting that. I've been so busy through the week. Um, the last I seen it was only at 66. So what you're saying is I got to post more shorts. Hey, now. Okay, energy weapons and overheating. Energy weapons produce heat when fired, when this can ultimately result in overheating. When overheated, the weapons will be temporarily disabled, but functionality will be regained once the weapon has been allowed to cool. Avoid overheating by monitoring your fi rate of fire. I was not ex yeah, I was not expecting that outcome. I'm like, eh, I'm going to give it a try. I'm going to like, find a situation on Tears of the Kingdom and see how it fares. Just to test the waters. I do want to post another one um, this week, so I'm going to try to get one posted tomorrow. But the ones I want to do take kind of a lot of work. Ricocheting will occur when enemies have high defense, significantly reducing the damage by the take. Uh, to counteract this, try attacking at closer range or switch to explosive weapons. Okay, that explains why my grenade launch launcher works so well. I am not I forgot I had this rocket launcher. Oh, he's going to clock me. I thought it was going to kill me. Find uploaded video helpful. I, um... Yeah, I think I might have to start looking into that because... That... But that build that I just used isn't something I typically like. I like a... All-around physical build. I don't like energy weapons too much. I'll use one or two like that uh, back cannon that I picked up. But I don't think I'd um, divulge into too much um, all energy weapon builds. But yeah, I wasn't used to fighting um, heavy um, armored guys like that and not having my energy sword 
really sucked. Okay, that's that one. And this one. What does this do? Okay, that's the energy weapon I was just using. Okay, there we go. I think that's it. We're going to do maybe one more mission and call it a night. Replay missions you have previously completed from the replay mission menu. You can also review your rank of each mission or yeah, review rank for each mission from this menu. To achieve a S rank rating, you must complete the mission without re relying or retrying from a checkpoint while also destroying a large number of enemies, targets, and minimizing incoming damage, time taken, and ammunition consumed. Okay. Missions. Operation Wall Climber. Assist the assault of the Rubicon Liberation Front stronghold and destroy the Juggernaut heavy mobile artillery platform. So then I should probably stick with heavy um, explosive damage weapons. I, I don't know with the guy the named Snail. The wall, a key trading outpost fortified by the Rubicon Liberation Front. Okay. The rabble have formed a defensive line comprised of artillery and MT squads. Okay. Break through the line, then make your way to the top of the wall. Okay, but why is there your name you Snail? Find the juggernaut, a mobile heavy artillery platform. Destroy it. V4 will also be participating in this mission, infiltrating through a separate route. However, be aware that Balaam has also taken a crack at the wall, only for their vainglorious hopes to be dashed. Do try not to die like a dog out there. For, for trying to be dashed. Hmm. Interesting. Um, uh, we'll see how that goes. Say, Tommy, do you upload any videos? I'm just curious. I don't know if I want to go with this. I think I'm going to stick with my cannon. No, just that. Okay, um... No. Your objective <laughs> is to take the Has it ever been whimsy or wonder? the credits and more <laughs> Dining hunting is definitely a game of patience Oh my god, I'm going to die just from trying to get over here. What? 
What happened? What was that? What was that? Am I like Icarus? Flying too close to the sun? Progressing too quickly? Holy shit! Oh my god! I know I walked right into that, but still, I was not expecting to have much of a resistance. This, this mission's gonna be a little harder than I thought. Main system, activating combat mode. Commence mission. We'll start. Maybe if I go in from this side. Ow! Owie! Do I go down here? Will this be better? Nice, buddy. Uh, that's fine. We're going to be ending soon, anyways. Ow. This other guy that's shooting at me. Ooh, these guys are spicy. Ah! Scared me a little bit. Repair kit remaining. <laughs> um, no, I'm not. Okay. Hi, Bank. How are you doing today? Please be nice to me. Also, I'm not stuck on the wall. It's so hot summer in Thailand here. Is it really hot over in Thailand? I'm in Wisconsin, like. The hottest weather we got. Oh shit, I did not see you there. Um, it's like 55 degrees so far.
do not like this mission at all. We got no, no repair kit. It's not like hottest in general. I'm just saying like lately, that's like the hottest we've had. For the season so far. Thirty-nine. One shot and I'm dead. I am not a fury. It's just um, that's been my username for the longest time. It's been like my gamer tag since I started gaming. I just really like cats. I'm a crazy cat dad. We'll start by clearing the way for Archibus. Take out the Gatling cannons protecting the city. And I do like Nintendo. This is like actually the first uh, PC game I've streamed so far. I'm um, starting kind of get that way because I didn't realize this was going to be such a fucking show. Excuse my French. Two repair kits remaining. Yeah, my mascot is just like my lovable, annoying pet. Gosh dang it, I screwed up. Maybe, maybe I've got it figured out. Nah, no, nope, not if I keep taking hits like that. Okay, where, where is this guy? He's like right above me. Ooh, dude, dive down. I took that down. That'll help. Maybe a little bit. Is that an AC? Dang it, I'm stuck at a bad angle. Oh, just a big MT. Heavily armored one. Oh, I shot. I blew my load too fast.
I'm done. He's got me. Oh, I barely got him. Yeah, but I'm pretty much dead. Hmm. I'm going to have someone big come through towards the end. I know it. I can see it. Oh shit, why did I run out in the open like an idiot? He's got armor on. The friendly MT squad will take care of the city. Please be over. Access the bulkhead and break into the wall. Oh no, I don't <laughs> oh, no. I just came from that way. Please don't show me. I'm just the boy. I'm just a poor boy from a poor family. Please, please spare me this life from this monstrosity. Confirmed. You're inside the wall. Be prepared for close quarters combat. Oh no! Do you see my AP? That's a big NO! want to die to one of these wieners. Do you read me? This is V4 Rusty. You're fast. Guess you're sharper than they say. I'll have to step up my own game. The numbered Vesper is an elite. But remember, even Malo couldn't crack the wall. Don't count on him too much. He got me. He got me. Hmm. I think this was not a good place to just throw me in, buddy. That was not nice. Right in front of a freaking cannon. Change weapon? Oh crap. What should, what would you have recommended me change it to? Oh yeah, that just run past them. Good, good idea. Yeah, I'm going to have to fight another AC, ain't I? Just do it if you want. I'm sorry. 
Oh, uh, I'm sorry. I'm like happy clicker. I just wanted to jump right back into it. I've been just kind of too lazy to change out the rocket launcher. I don't know if that's what you're pointing at. You don't mess with the purple arm. Um, I am not. I've played, um, I've played two, um, three. I played the one that came out on Xbox. I played Last Raven. Um, that's pretty much my experience. I know I played one other, but I can't remember exactly what it was. Oh, that's cool. Have you played a lot of the AC series? Uh, Last Raven was a lot. Like, it did take me a few tries, and I did, um, play through about... I can't remember if it had eight alternate endings. I think before I got burnt out, I made it through five of them. But yeah, it was a lot. And I think there was one mission where you just pretty much got a... Oh... You were supposed to go on with this one raven, but he ended up going against you with the other one, and you had to kill him before he got to the other guy. He's... Oh. Okay, he's on my side. You ready to climb the wall? I hope... Oh my god! I didn't know he could do that. He's no pro. Hey, I'm a pro when I want to be. I gotta get in there. Oh shit, I got back up. Okay, that hurt him. No, no, I don't like those updates. Please finish, finish without you. That is the most horrible, like, first date. Um, <laughs> thing I've ever heard. Nothing's hurting him. Fun fact, after you beat this guy, you'll finish its tutorial. <laughs> Could you imagine if that's how it was this whole time? Is this like classic like Zelda stuff where I gotta let him run into a wall or something?
Oh shit, he's got me. Fudge! Yep, he's got me now. Charge! Oh shit. Mistake. I was getting neck cramps from that too. Tell me, Wild, has any of this game so far made you think, oh, this is like Zelda? No. <laughs> He's been hazing me with the death thing. <laughs> or, um, with the tutorial. It is, it is the first one. Um, you think I should change my weapons? I don't think I, I don't think my weapons would really make much of a difference. It's just, I gotta, um, get behind them. Otherwise, he's just going to run over me like I'm, ro like a rodent on the road. I'm roadkill to him. Yeah. Um, I don't think I have a choice. If I want to restart from the checkpoint, I think I have to use the weapons I accumulated. Ah! Why? Me too. Oh, he can back up over me. Why? Why did I think he couldn't do that? because there's no way I can possibly lose. No. One repair kit remaining. One repair kit. No. Bad. This is not a good first date. You do not look like your profile picture. <laughs> AP 
Yeah, 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 I know. I, I know, I know, I know. You don't have to remind me of how much I'm getting my ass kicked right now. Oh shit, I'm in our way! I can, I think I'm out. There we go. Just going tea bake him while he blows up right under me. And by <laughs> pilot, Rusty. It seems he knew who you really are. That was one hell of a military thing. I've taken that contingency into account. Oh, I did have a repair kit on me. <laughs> I thought I was out. You were right. Ooh, I made an achievement. But chat box was in the way. Oh, Jesus. What the hell? That was that was a lot. One new message. My achievement was a chat box. Like, congratulations. You've ha you have more than one chatter. <laughs> We're war buddies now. I think I should tell you something. During Operation Wall Climber, Archibus was planning to sacrifice you. The plan was to use independent mercenaries to clear the way so that the Vespers could step in and take over. But instead, you took the wall. Yeah, because I'm awesome. The higher ups are going to remember you now, that's for sure. And I as well. Like, like a real wildcat, I have like nine lives. It took me at least four four times <laughs> to clear that. I um I have seen some streams where um people only have had one chatter the whole entire time and I felt bad. But the thing is like I joined in on them too and then they never interacted with me. I'm like, okay, I, I, I tried to help you out. Uh, ooh, what is this? I think that's a... Is that a metal finder? Am I going to find some coins on the ground? A pulse gun. So we literally went from armored core to halo at this rate. I mean, that's interesting. I kind of want to try it it's not it doesn't have bad stats I prefer smaller streamers rather than big ones whose chat goes up I um Lobos Jr. the person I brought them up a couple times but watching their streams it's um it's difficult because they just have their chat box like only uh shows about three feeds at a time and every second every second it changes no i get what you mean db use it for the to destroy pulse armor see i'm like not that adept enough to understand or identify the difference between the pulse armor and um everything else Or are you talking about like the heavy armored units? Because when you say pulse armor, I'm assuming that they're all energy based units. I could give it a try. Yeah, 
Yeah, that's true. <laughs> right. I get that. Um, mm, I do. I do really like this plasma rifle, though. I want to use it, but I have to upgrade my build. Um, my engine is the default engine when you um start playing. Are you talking about my whole entire unit in general? Because I've like changed nothing except for weapons right at the moment. I <laughs> I knew that's exactly what you were gonna tell me to do, Bank. Um Yeah, I know I I've been <laughs> It's sad, but I've been being really cheap and I wanted to see how far I can get on this build. I'm I'm a greedy person on games and real life, so I don't uh just get good. <laughs> I thought I did fairly decent, it only took me one two resets on that last boss. Okay, let's go to the parts. Um I like well rounded units, so I don't want to go with high mobility. But I like mobility. And the way I always start my builds, I start from the legs and I move up. Ooh, I could be a spider. I could be a tank too. I don't like I don't like the tank build. I don't like the spider builds either. Spider to me is like heavy um back weaponry. Yeah, <laughs> you're still trying on rush fam. I'm a pro Aquabus because I like lasers. I do like the lasers, but um, in the past, I don't know if it's because of my skill using them or if I just had a poor um, setup with the generator and everything. But um, it ended up failing me a lot. But lasers are good for overheating units, correct? What did you forget to say, DB? And the thighs on this guy, though, are really appealing, so... These aren't bad. Everything goes down, though. Um... Tomorrow on April 8th, online services for 3DS are going to be shut down. Pokemon Bank will stay up, but we are not sure for how long. Okay, yeah, is that... That's pretty similar to what I posted on Discord, correct? <laughs> Mecca, see? <laughs> we, we have a long-going... Um, regular chatters and that, we have a long-going uh, joke about us seeing... It sounds so wrong saying that out loud, but we'll sing um, behind the name. So uh, it began with the great Rayquaza, which we called um, Rayquasi. And then it's been um, a horrible landslide after that. I wonder if I go with my core. I don't like any of the cores. Maybe this one. I'm I think I'm good on the weight. I'm not at max weight. Yeah. It's more attractive as a dragon. <laughs> I mean, uh <laughs> I I got no defense against that. I'm not I, I got no defense. I can't say anything. I can't justify that whatsoever.
Oh, I could go with the, like that thick, big body build. Maybe, okay, I'm going to give this a shot. That's uh, expensive. I don't... I have the head I want. Hmm. I did. I, I, um, yes, I did. Those are expensive arms. Oh, God. Maybe I'll go with this. I feel like I'm making big mistakes right now. I do like the legs, though. Should I, should I go with spider legs? Should I just be a, be a little spider? You know what? The heck with it. I'm going to give it, give these a shot. I'm going to build my armor, but my weight isn't going to be horrible. And I like to experimenting a lot. Very little match, and you poured gasoline on a fire. <laughs> I, I um, I did in real life accidentally light a friend on fire with gasoline. Um, at his fire that he was having, so um, I, I do have a bad tendency of doing that, yes. Ooh, I got more training. That's perfect, because I can see how this actually works. Okay, um... Tetapod. Is it called... Tetra tetrapod leg units have high loading capacity and enable AC builds equipped with multiple heavy weapons Tetrapod ACs can switch to hover mode after ascending Off from the ground allowing them to remain suspended in the air for some time. I could actually benefit off of that Hahaha <laughs> Okay, perfect. Wow, that thing really hovers for a while. And that's really good energy output too. Charge attacks and fire from heavy weapons such as grenade launchers cause more recoil than other attacks, forcing AC to assume a firing stance. Tetrapods are capable of absorbing this kind of recoil, allowing these attacks to be executed during movement. Problem is they're slow. They're faster, like hovering. They're faster hovering, but that uses a lot of energy. And not really good with dodging, I think. Hover mode allows you to maintain a high altitude, in turn making it easier to establish a line of fire and lock on without geographical obstructions. Oh, and 
dude did not like that. Kind of like I was shot him. Oh, that was it. Ooh, a grenade launcher. I think um, we're going to do one more mission and we're going to call it a night. Because it's 12 p.m. my th or 12 a.m. my time. Okay, this one. Recover at least five combat logs from empty racks. It's a low amount to pay out. There's most definitely a hidden item here. Six red. Such, he'll be targeting the brief window where their main force is deployed elsewhere. Keep an eye on the time and retrieve as many logs as you can. I'm gonna have to fight him eventually. Him or her. Briefing. Hard to say. We expect prompt results, Gun 13. I assume. They they is a correct term. Sortile! Let's do this! Yeah, let's go team. Should be used to Rubicon by now. Time to take a break from shooting up. The Maybe place. it's both or neither. Maybe it's just a robot. How do you identify a robot? Main system activating combat mode. Combat mode. Commence mission. Oh, I do not have a lot of time. This is a... I'm long one side engagement. This gives us some more insight about skills. Okay, I gotta find these guys. Where do I go? Five of them, right? Pentient gun. <laughs> Some more evidence on what the coral situation looks like. We have unlimited time to read the log. The time the game will not run. Okay, I got gotcha. you. I was like happy clicking through the logs. I should have read them more. Whoa, 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 buddies. Settle down, settle down. You don't have to be so rough. Okay, nothing here. Um, just a yes or no, it's still going to drive me crazy no matter what. Is there a hidden part on this map? There's none here. Oh, there's people here. Nothing here. Oh, 
Oh, I won't fail this because of time. Ignore that. I I just jumped that shot. Keep an eye on the clock. That makes three logs. Okay, that's three. Uh, comms record extractor rock appears to be conversion between alias prior to the start of mission. We can't beat the top Vesper. Vespers, yep. Or as good as that. At least Z Zeal? Z? Is off duty. She's the Liberation Front's little sister. She doesn't deserve to be out here on the battlefield. She can still love and be loved. Have a family. Oh. Worthless. Okay, one more. I'm doing good. Oh shit, I thought I was analyzing! Uh, how could you? I, I know who you are. I've seen Uncle's files. At least tell me why. Very interesting. This could be worth something. I don't have time for your little wieners. I don't, I said that completely wrong. I don't have time for you wieners. Oh, I don't like that crying emoji. Don't tell me I messed up. Oh no. Almost out of time, 621. I know I am. Oh, is it down here? I found the last one. That's five logs. <laughs> All right. I know they regarded an offensive and it appears that the pilot was crafted immediately pulled from your eject lever and started the line operation. Okay. Nothing we can sell here. Isn't that what I was supposed to do? Wrap it up. Archibus's main force will be here any minute now. We've got enough logs to satisfy the request. That's it. That's it. Six two one. Return to base. I don't like that crying face. I got like paid nothing for that mission. Okay. Um, this is where we're going to end it. It is time. Two new messages. I have to get to bed. I gotta listen to these messages. I do serve these evil companies. Um, because they pay me, they are kind of monsters, to be honest. Additionally, I'll introduce myself. Yeah, I'll check that out. I'll probably check that right after this. Privileged to be among Balaam's best, even if I am stuck whipping you independence into shape. Leave you me. I'm gonna put you to work. It is like throughout the whole entire franchise of Armored Core, the companies are just straight up evil. There's probably a small handful of companies that are actually decent. But they're pretty much all monsters. Granting authorization to perform ACOS upgrades. Mm -hmm. Additional. All Mind hereby invites you to the Arena Combat Aptitude Evaluation Program. Mm -hmm. The Arena is a virtual combat simulator designed to support the development of registered mercenaries. It also serves as a benchmark to appraise and rank the mercenaries active on Rubicon. We look forward to your participation. Oh, yeah. I, I suppose I'll. I'll t test the waters a little bit. Oh yes, tuning arena. Um, I'm going to hold out on the arena and the OS tuning. We are going to call it a night right now. Uh, but we will continue this all same time, 8 p.m. CST tomorrow. Um, but I'm going to say thank you all for watching. Thank you for the support. Uh, if you haven't 
haven't already or if you enjoy the content don't forget to like or follow or subscribe um anyways thank you all for watching hope you tune in tomorrow and have a terrific weekend or uh not weekend good night god i don't want to end the week early <laughs> anyways thanks again ciao everyone Thank you.